In the governmental relations area, you are contacted by typically businesses or public charities that have issues before the legislature or before the executive branch of government. If they have problems that possibly can be resolved through the legislative process or with uh, the executive, then uh, assuming there's no conflict of interest or other problem with representing them, you undertake to deal with their issues and pursue them as best you can. We do try to explain the legislative process and the amount of effort that you're probably going to have to expend to get a bill killed or to get a bill through. But most clients in that area are quite accustomed to the legislative process either in this state or one of the sister states or the United States Congress. So none of it really comes as a surprise to them, but they do need to understand whether or not they're dealing with a matter that involves heavy lifting, where there's going to be a great deal of resentment or a great deal of resistance from vested interests or from a, polit a particular political party or the executive branch of government. And that can be explained and they either decide to go forward or not. I like meeting judges and the individuals that you serve as part of the process. I also like studying the law and thinking about it. I've practiced law for 38 years in this state and I've developed a great many relationships throughout government and throughout the agencies. I also bring fairly good judgment as to what is appropriate to pursue and what isn't, not only with regard to administrative agencies and the legislature, but also with regard to the courts. And I bring enthusiasm. My client's cause becomes my cause. What I like about the practice of law is meeting people and helping them with their problems. Currently, I serve on the board of trustees of the Washburn University Foundation. I'm also on the board of uh, Freedom's Frontier. I'm a member of the board of the t local Topeka Bar Association. And currently, I'm serving as the president of the Topeka Bar. Anybody that would like to learn more about Fulston Siefkin's governmental relations and administrative law practice only has to get on the phone and call.